Hello YouTube, my name is Captain Darren and my call sign is N4VFR. Do you own a Windows laptop or a Windows desktop computer? And are you using the C4FM or using your Yaesu FT3D as a portable digital note? This video is for you because sometimes Windows will update your USB drivers and now you're no longer going to communicate with the USB port to connect to your PDN. Stay tuned. The cable I have there is the SCU19. It's the interface cable that connects your, your Windows laptop to your handheld Yaesu FT3D. Sometimes you might do a Windows update, like update all, and uh, it has a prolific USB driver update. Well, when I did that, my connection from the laptop to the radio no longer worked. So if that happened to you, uh, continue to watch my videos. I'm going to show you how to uninstall the driver the prolific driver that Windows has updated your system with. My current configuration, I have the SCU19 connected to my Dell laptop and the FT3D. I'm going to share you my display screen. I'm going to show you that it's working with the prolific drivers that was downloaded from the Yaesu website. And then I will show you afterwards the update that window will make to your prolific drivers and uh, show you that it's no longer communicating with the my portable digital node on the FT3D and uh, finally I will show you how to uninstall the drivers from Windows 11 and install or reinstall the prolific drivers that was provided through the Yesu website. Let's take a look at the prolific drivers just to verify it's installed. Go to your search, window search, go look for device manager. All right. Device manager, you're looking for ports. Double click on ports and you see there I have the prolific USB to serial COM port. Mine is COM port 4. So it's installed properly. Now let's test Wires X to see if it's still working. Double click on the Wires X software. It's going to take about a few minutes to populate and uh, to get all the room IDs. Everything's populated. Let's go to America Link. Highlight that. Do a right mouse click. And then I'm going to connect. Whiskey Delta 7 Lima. This is November 4, Victor Foxtrot Romeo. I read you loud and clear. How me over? All right, copy. Yeah, this is uh, my name is Daniel, um, and I'm out of Russian Oregon, and you're coming in nice and clean uh, through my radio, through uh, America Link. Uh, this is with your, uh, your whatsoever. I right, well, thank you. I really appreciate the radio check. Uh, uh, I just got this new radio, so uh, just playing with it. And Whiskey 7 Delta Juliet Lima, yeah, good afternoon to you. Nice meeting you. Thank you for the uh, return uh, radio check to me. Uh, my name is Captain Darren. I'm recording this uh, conversation for my YouTube channel. So uh, take a look on my YouTube channel. Just uh, 
look up my call sign. This is November 4, Victor, Boxtrot, Romeo, 73s. Okay, good radio check. And now I'm going to disconnect from America Link. Let me close that. Disconnect there. Close it out. All right, so now everything is working, and what we're going to do now is uh, say that you want to do a Windows update. So you go down to your uh, search, and then you type in update, and then you check for updates. All right, so I show that there's a prolific port 3.8.40.0, and it's pending install. All right. And I still have the cable still connected to the machine, to my laptop. So I want to install it now. It's installing. You can see down here it is a percentage. Uh, okay. It's installed. Let's check for any other updates. There's no other updates. Very good. X out of there and go back to my device manager and let's take a look at the prolific driver and if it's see, see if it's still there so now it's showing please install corresponding PL2303 driver to support Windows 11 and future OS that's what's showing now let's open up wires X Okay, now remember earlier it was on COM4. Now it's not displaying anything. So it's it's not going to work. You can manually put in the COM port 4 in there. See, it doesn't even show me that there's any COM port connected. But you can go serial port and then say COM port 4 and click OK and I'm still showing nothing no connectivity it says invalid device all right now let's do this let's keep the cable the USB cable plugged in I turned off my radio all right it's still connected now let's turn off the radio Keep the, keep the cables connected to the computer. Let's go and uninstall the driver. Go to Device Manager. Double click on Ports. Highlight the port where it says please install corresponding PL2 303 drivers to support Windows 11. Right click and let's uninstall that driver. And click on the box here. It says attempt to remove the driver for this device. Uninstall. All right. Now, when you look down to your device manager, you no longer see the port. Okay. In my earlier videos, I'm going to leave a link above and uh, click on that link to, to learn how to download the uh, prolific USB drivers. I have it already downloaded in my downloads folder and it's the SCU19 PC connection cable driver. Just double click on that, double click on the application. Click on yes. First, we have to remove the driver. So you see it there, it says remove. Let's click next and type yes. Uninstall is complete. Finish. 
you don't need to reboot your computer. Okay, now let's just re double click the driver. Let me back out of there. Let's go back to my downloads folder. Okay, SCU19. And re double click. Click yes. And it's going to reinstall the drivers. Click next and then it is completed. Click finish. Again, you don't need to reboot the computer. Close that out. Let's go back to device manager. Okay. I don't see it there, the COM port. Okay, so if you don't see the COM port, uh, the port section, disconnect the USB cable and then replug it in. Ports. There it is. Now we're back to the prolific USB to serial COM port 4. That's my computer. It's COM port 4. There's America Link, and uh, let's connect to America Link again. So we have good connectivity because I've connected successfully. Currently, there are 114 nodes online. This is November 4, Victor Foxtrot Romeo, radio check. This is Whiskey 7, Delta Julia Lima. Uh, you're making it through. Okay, very good. I see that you're also on the FT3D. Uh, very good. I just did a, a reinstall of my prolific USB drivers successfully. Well, you've reached the end of my video. I hope you learned something and think about whether if you want to update your USB prolific drivers. My name is Captain Darren. My call sign is N4BFR. For those that have subscribed to my channel, thank you very much. Until next video, have a great day.